good. I'm fine. I'm fine. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I think... I think it could have been better. Yeah. I think it could have been better. Um... Hmm. I mean, well... Not really. <laughs> yeah, not... Not, not really. Yeah, 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 I did. I did. Um, but they're not with me anymore. It wasn't. It really wasn't. <laughs> I wish I can say it was, but it wasn't. I didn't achieve anything in 2022. the time that everyone is making videos on how much they've achieved in 2022 and not gonna lie it makes me feel pretty awful about myself because my 2022 didn't go entirely as planned and at the beginning of 2022 i decided to start posting on youtube but in all honesty i posted some things just to post i didn't put in as much time into my content or editing because I was like, what is the point? Since it's not like anyone is going to watch it. I had no idea what I wanted to do. And then I met new people. But soon after another, I fell out of the friendships. Some were due to me realizing how little respect they had for me as a human being. And some were due to incompatibility. From experience, the second one hurts more. I became so fixated on these friendships that I lost all track of my goals. Well, it's not like I had any, to be honest. Majority of 2022 felt like I was just trying to live through it. I was just surviving. I had no passions or any desires. I didn't feel like going out because I felt like I wasn't allowed to. I carried so much shame for doing the simplest things. I was alive just to get through the day. I focused on nothing besides the future with friends. It became so bad I put my being as a second option. I guess this didn't only apply to 2022. I think I always carried a lot of shame as a child and hyperfixate on friends. I always felt like nothing to be honest. Which is maybe why I focus on those around me instead to avoid thinking about the issues about myself. Recently, I realized it in the clearest manner. I realized I look into the potential of those around me. Because I become so used to being with others, I forgot how independent I can be. I forgot how capable I can be as a human being. I lost so much confidence in my entire being because I purely don't care what I can accomplish because I didn't want to accomplish anything. Because I believed it wasn't my place to.
friendship fallout was one of my darkest moments. I felt like a part of me went missing because I lost that security of the future I wanted with another person. Hence, November was pretty dark for me. However, I soon realized I was again by myself and that means I need to take accountability for myself. No one is there for me anymore but myself. And that motivated me. I tend to thrive when I have no one around me. I think it's because there are no distractions and no one to disappoint. I also realized how much time I have. I decided to start discovering both new and old hobbies of mine. I started to invest a lot of time into content making and editing. I started to carry a camera with me all the time and film things I considered to be pretty. It felt nice to do something that I cared to get better at. It made me feel fulfilled to create things I like looking at. After filming, I would go home and put the clips together. After a few days, I would then pick up things that I feel like could be better. Even weeks, months after, I would still be very critical of things I've made. I would then apply all the knowledge onto the next video and the process would repeat. I just want to be improving. It makes me feel better knowing I'm constantly learning. I soon realized I found a passion and that itself Because of this, I also started to go out more. I also realized how the winter air makes me feel so alive. The sensation of the cold air makes me feel how alive I am. I realized how easily my problems can go away when the sun hits me. That being said, I really don't think I accomplished much in 2022. I feel like I only slightly redeemed myself this last month of 2022. I'm currently a senior in college and a lot of my peers have already figured what they want to do after college. I have absolutely nothing figured out. 
that used to stress me out. It still makes me a bit unsettled, but it doesn't affect me as much as before. I think it's because I found something I like doing, and I want to continue doing it. I think that itself is a very great blessing, and I'm so thankful. I want to not lose myself in 2023. I want to figure out more of myself by enjoying my own solitude. I want to document them down and look back at them. I guess this is slowly becoming my public diary. Actually, pretty good. Um, I'm really excited for 2023. Um, there's a lot of things I want to create. And I also just feel like I'm a lot more capable now. Yeah, I'm excited. Hmm. Um, don't disappoint me in 2023. Okay, I'm kidding. Um, know that I will always have your back, okay? Remember that when you're doing things, I will always be close by. Um, and I want you to figure out what you like, who you like and who you are, I want you to create that sense of self. You don't need to find out who you are. You need to create who you want to be, okay? Um, but yeah, I'll see you then, okay? Anything more?